I had a patient who came to see me a few years ago that had dementia, and he got better. And I asked the neurologist who was treating with me, I said, how could that happen? He was a Harvard neurologist. He said, you know what? He said, the brain is sensitive to so many insults from the environment, from toxins, from our diet. He says, if you stop assaulting the brain and give it the ingredients to thrive, it can heal and recover. And that's exactly what happened to George, who came to see me at 70 with dementia. He couldn't manage his business. He couldn't remember what he was reading. He had personality changes. His wife wanted to leave him. He was unable to function. He became increasingly withdrawn. Conventional medicine knows there's no known treatment for dementia, but we do know what affects brain function and aging. It's nutrition. It's vitamin deficiencies, omega-3 fats, toxins, gut problems, inflammation, infection, stress. It's hormone imbalances and energy problems. Guess what? These are all of the seven keys to an ultra mind. In George, we addressed all these problems, but the main problem he had was mercury poisoning from living near cement plants his whole life and having a mouthful of fillings, right? He had also had the worst collection of what we call SNPs or genes that together made it very difficult for him to get rid of toxins that entered his body. So we didn't treat his diagnosis of dementia. We didn't treat this thing out there that doesn't really exist. We treated these imbalances and we did it by getting rid of the mercury and boosting his detox system. Now we safely removed his mercury fillings. Now not everybody who has mercury fillings should have them removed. But if you have a problem with being toxic, you may need them removed. So what about George's treatment? Well, what we did was we boost his glutathione, that sticky molecule that ejects toxins from your body. How do you do that? Well, you take things like foods, which are the best medicine, things like collards and kale and cabbage and Brussels sprouts and broccoli and watercress and cilantro and arugula, all of which help boost your liver's capacity to eject the toxins from your body. And we gave him herbs like milk thistle and special minerals that help remove metals from your body like zinc and selenium and a special molecule called NAC or NAC that boosts your body's own glutathione. And we also gave him these special B vitamins we talked about, B6, folate, and B12, because you know what? They're also at the hub of your detox system. And we gave him special medications to help bind the mercury and remove from his body. And then, what was the result? Well, after a year of treatment that was matched to his genes, not his diagnosis, that was matched to the imbalances in the seven keys, not his diagnosis of dementia, he had a remarkable and dramatic recovery from his symptoms. After one year, his memory improved. He could read and remember what he says. You know what? I can read Business Week now and understand it. He could run his business affairs. His grandkids, who didn't want to be with him because he was kind of acting weird, wanted to be with him again. He no longer isolated himself at home. He was an engaged member of his family and his community. And he told me he could actually sing in the shower now, remember all the songs that he used, used to sing that he had forgotten. <laughs>